is guys it's Melanie I'm gonna do another review video um, we're at the library and um, sorry this is not the best intro but anyway I'm currently doing the update so I figured I would film the intro for this guy it's a little boon ball that swivels open and you could put your snacks in there and we're gonna see if it actually stays shut you can make it fresh like this Should do it like this he likes to play with it let's see how well it holds up here is a look at it in the packaging. Super cute. I love Boone products. I have high hopes for this. I really hope that it works. Yeah. <laughs> this thing looks so cool, you guys. I cannot wait to see um, how well this thing, I think this thing is gonna hold up really well in my backpack when we travel, which I'm super excited about. We're gonna try this thing out at the zoo. We're also gonna try something else out at the zoo. Um, I'll link that below but this guy right here is so interesting it's a ball and it swivels and you can put snacks in there or maybe even toys you know what this would be good for those little teeny tiny toys that you get um, in surprise eggs you know what I'm talking about you can fit quite a few in there on the go or the snacks whatever you want to put in here and yeah, mommy. yeah my three-year-old wants to help me come say hi sissy you want it hi Hi, say hi. I can't see your face. Where's your pretty face? Say hi. Hi. So, um, yeah, we're just going to test this out. We're going to uh, put some stuff in it. We're going to go to the zoo tomorrow. Oh, okay, she's done taking over. What is this called again? It is called the snack ball, as appropriate. Anyway, oh! Ah! <laughs> All right, you guys, this looks really cool, really simple. I thought we would just test it out, see how well it stays shut in my bag. Obviously, she's the most amused by this. Oh. Yeah, we got to match this up. And we got to match this up really that <laughs> You tell them. All right, let's test it out. Are you ready? Yeah. Yeah. All right, you guys, so if you've seen this somewhat same shot. It's also because I'm filming these the same day. They're both boom containers. Anyway, you guys, this has been in the bottom of my, well, it was in the top. It made its way to the bottom of the bag, my bag. And we walked around the zoo today, you stinker. And now we're at the library and it has not opened, which I'm very surprised considering it's a swing open top. I, see it. I was so prepared for it to open. Here, let me show them what's inside. That I didn't put loose snacks and I actually put little packaged gummies you want some in case it opened and it hasn't opened at all so i'm actually pretty impressed so far so good all right you guys we are at the zoo today um if you've watched the video for this you know already know that we're at the zoo um but i have this and this guy well, with me you know seeing if they both work um so far this has not opened in the bag i put um these guys in there yet again because i'm still afraid it's going to open but it hasn't opened and I've been, you want it? I've been um, running around with the kids, jumping up and down, and it's not open so far. Yeah. She just likes it because it's yeah, a ball. Yeah, it's really good for like a toddler. Little. Oh yeah, show them how the lid comes off. I didn't know this. Whenever I stuck the food in, I yeah, just stuck it yeah, in but, on the top. Yeah, but when I was eating this, I dropped my spoon two times and that was yes. dirty. He dropped his dipping yeah. dot spoon. It's very yeah. important that you guys know this. Yeah, <laughs> yeah and I was getting a new one, but yeah, but this Daddy is got you a new one. Like. Yeah, it, yeah, that's a lot of liquid. When they melt, yeah, that's right. Show them how. Good job, sissy. This would be really cool for a toddler because it's like a toy, but you could put like little puffs in there or something. Super cool, you guys. But yeah. it hasn't opened, so you, I think you, I actually trust this not to inside. open now. You could too, huh? Yeah. So far, so good, guys. So far, so good. Hello, it's me um, at 1 a.m. with no makeup on after a two-day migraine. I look great, right? Anyway, um, yes, I'm going to do a video wrap-up. It's been a couple months. We filmed this when it was still nice out, like beginning September, and it's Christmas time. So I'm going to do a wrap-up. I'm going to show you guys some more video of the product while I tell you if it's still holding up, if it's broken, and if we've had any accidents with it. So anyway, let's, maybe I should just blur it out my face. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. It officially has been a couple months. We use this often. It has some pros. It has some cons. We still really like it. Um, a definite pro is that my kids, they, they just love to play with it. It is a round ball. They can play with it. There is food inside. If you have a small child 
or a toddler or a special needs kid maybe that doesn't really want to eat or a picky eater, they might be more likely to eat because it's like a toy. You know what I'm saying? Um, an, a con with it being a ball is it does roll whenever you set it on a table. Um, so we, of course, we try not to do that. We just keep a hold of it or stick it like in the cup section of our stroller, that kind of thing. It does unscrew in the middle, which can be convenient. But um, if it's not tight enough, my three-year-old can get it on. Uh, can unscrew it herself and like her snacks will fall out so be careful make sure that is tight enough especially if you have a toddler but I don't really see a toddler being able to unscrew it um, the top part it takes a little bit of practice for my three-year-old to swivel it um, which is good because that way you know she's not just like dumping it everywhere um, that's not exactly like a safety what I would call a safety lid like the other one we did a review for where it doesn't like spill when it, the swivel lid is open it can spill a little bit so I try not to put too many snacks in here at one time, if that makes sense. Um, but my kids do like it a lot. Um, as far as if it the swivel has opened in my backpack, it's only opened once out of every single time I've put it in there, which is like at least once a week for the past couple months, which is pretty impressive to me. And that was because I had it like squished up a bunch with a bunch of other stuff and it kind of like rubbed it open. Um, but yeah, it opened once out of every single time, which impressed me because I thought for sure. But the snap on it when it locks is actually pretty good. So, so far so good. It has not like broken down or like broken or anything uh, so far. Um, so I have high hopes for it. And I really like it because if my daughter doesn't want to eat, sometimes I can give her a little snack in there and she'll eat it because she thinks it's just like a toy, which is super cool. I would definitely recommend these for like little teeny tiny surprise toys also for when you're traveling. Um but yeah, that is it. If you guys are interested, we also did a different, like a spill-free like lid that goes on a bowl that's also from Boone. I'll link it below. And we did their sippy cups and different stuff too. But yeah, that is it. I would totally recommend this for travel. I just don't recommend packing it full if you have a kid that knows how to unscrew it. But that is it. Anyway, my daughter wants to come sing. Oh, yes, honey. Of course. That is it. Please stay. Please subscribe for more review videos, mom stuff, DIYs, money saving. Um, yeah. All right. That's it. Bye, y'all. Love you. Want to say bye? No? Okay, cool. <laughs>